A capsized boat leaves a victim running out of time as exhaustion and hypothermia set in. Distress calls like this all too familiar in Long Island waters. And now... Nassau 5, 10 of our units. Rescue stick is deployed. A tool to save lives. Nassau and Suffolk Police training together to use a rescue stick device. It can be dropped 120 feet above a swimmer in distress from a police chopper. So it lands feet from the victim, then self-inflates when it hits the water. Seconds make a world of difference. Uh, they'll keep this device will keep you afloat and able to breathe and out of the water. And it also gives us an excellent way to find you on the water. A game changer. Yeah, yeah. So simple, but an effective tool to affect the water rescue and possibly save someone's life. So simple makes you wonder why a special tool is needed. But aviation officers explain you can't throw a life preserver or ring out of a chopper as it could get sucked into the rotors. This device, $150 a piece weighs only a pound but drops straight down with accuracy, providing nearly instant flotation, saving precious time waiting for a rescue boat. We were able to get it within 10 to 20 feet of the victim, which is what we want. The county is training together because they often respond together. A lot of times an emergency call will go out in the vicinity of, uh, there's no street signs um, and multiple <laughs> aviation and marine assets will be deployed and it's really all hands on. The Nassau PD is buying 50 of the rescue sticks to distribute not only to its marine and aviation units, but also to its patrol cars. Because the sticks can be thrown from land, too. Together, both counties responded to nearly 400 water emergencies last year. Not all boaters wear recommended life vests. Now, this flotation device can get to them. Off Tobey Beach on Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News.